All right, welcome everybody back to Tori 1.3 expert mode. You see, I got like a billion things in my inventory. Uh, I did a lot of things off him. And right now we're gonna go ahead to the dungeon because I want to fight Skeletron. I didn't know it was about to be nighttime when we're starting. Oops. Uh, but I've been meaning to fight Skeletron because I think he's one of the easier expert mode bosses. He doesn't have too much difference to him. Uh, we shouldn't need the whole night, but we will need a good part of the night. So, uh, I'm gonna just head over here. I may look extremely weird just because I got a die trader. And, uh, you can trade the die trader, these strange plants which you can find, like, all around the world randomly. And, uh, she will give you, like, weird colored dyes. It's actually really cool. That's what I've been doing. I've been getting, like, all these different dyes. And I was like, what the hell? This is mix and match, and, uh, now I look like a creep. I've been rocking, uh, let's see, what color I've been rocking. I think I've been rocking something like this. Something like this, and then the blue acid dye. Yeah, there you go. Back to normal. It looks really cool. But, uh, yeah, let's see if we can get over here to Skeletron really quick and build a arena really fast. This didn't take that long. And we're almost there, I believe. Should be almost there. Right? Right, 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 right. Come on, come on, right? Yeah. Yeah, 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 we're close, but yeah, 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 okay, I'll stop now, so, uh, if we look at my inventory here, I went to three different sky islands, look at our mini-map, there's a couple of them, lying around, I think that's a sky lake, so, I, I used gravitation potion, two of them, and I went on the hunt for sky islands, and found, like, five of them, and I was able to get every item that I know of in the Sky Islands. I don't know if they added anything new. And, uh, hey, old man. We'll just turn nighttime. Thank God for that. And one of them we got is a Star Fury. This thing is awesome. It's always an awesome item to have. Ooh, give me that slow-ass moving crafting inventory. Uh, so. Let's set us up an arena here. Now, the best arena I know for this guy and the best way I think I'm going to defeat this guy is using yo-yo. Uh, and we're going to go... Oops, what the fuck? Alright, we're going to go a little bit far away here. Oops. And then we're going to... God damn, there's already dudes trying to attack me. Come on, man. Give me some, give me some peace right here. Give me some peace. Now i got to like waste time and kill this dude. Do I have cream tank? God damn, I shouldn't make cream tank. We're just gonna go, we're gonna go for like a, a regular fight here, okay? We're gonna go for a regular fight, see uh, a little, well I guess a little mock-up fight. See where we end up doing this fight. Uh, if we need to do improvements or what, or if we can just beat them nice and easily without having too much major preparation. And that's what I'm hoping for. Because uh, I did prep a lot. I was trying to find a sword that I've never ever used in a regular playthrough. Uh, because it's really hard to find. And it's the enchanted sword. And it's the one you can just like find underground in a rock. I've never seen that sword before and I really wanted to use it in this playthrough since we're melee. Because I feel like it would be amazing. But yeah, we're going with something like this. I saw a video of Yuri Mir. Yuri, Yuri, Yuri Mir. You pronounce his name? I have no clue. Uh, he did this and uh, I like it. I like it. I like it. Sonar potion. We don't want that. Alright, we good? What the fuck? Alright. 4% melee speed. Let's probably want to counterweight, don't we? Probably. That might help out. So, let's do this. Hey, man. Shit, that's not a good start. I don't know why my character didn't dash. That was an accidental dodge, but it looked like it worked out perfectly. So, thing with uh, Skeletron, you want to take out his hands. And, uh, he, he just flops around all the time. A lot more, and his hands are a lot more deadly. Holy shit, what happened to my health? His hands are a lot more deadly, to say the least. Oh my god, what was that? That dude sl like had his hand a mile away from his head. Uh-oh. Yeah, he's just creep. Oh my god, yeah, we're definitely not gonna win this fight. I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
Uh oh. Oh my god, yeah, we're dead. Okay, well. I'm not even gonna try and dodge anything. I didn't expect to accomplish much. Uh, I just wanted to see a level where he's at right now, I guess we can say. Like, how hard he is with what we have. And I think the thing that's gonna get us the most is not having Crimtain armor. And, uh, my fault trying to rush it. I just really didn't want to wait a whole other night. So now I gotta wait, like, what, like 20 minutes just to fight him again? I don't want I didn't want to do that. It's like 12 a.m. right now. I'm trying to go to bed soon. But, uh, I guess we'll wait. Can we sell this negative die? I don't really want to. So, let me show you how this works. See, I put a die on my heart, too. And it's pretty disgusting. Oh, yeah, we got the fisherman. I've been doing quests for him. Oh, and then we got the... Oh, wait. I don't know if I said anything about the two whoopee cushions in my inventory. So, I've been having, like, the best time with the worms. And now I can make an item I don't think I've made since like 1.1 because that was the last time I got a whoopee cushion it was 1.1 I'm gonna make the fart in a jar boom spike fart in a jar that's disgusting that is disgusting <laughs> this is the best this is the best double jump you can have thanks for the reflective metal die ew that's weird purple ooze I guess it's not that bad yeah I don't like that one. Oh my god. We need to have a die, uh, die chest. Because I've been working on trying to get these chests going. I uh, get a little bit more organized. Can I, can I stack anything in here? I don't think I can. Let's put dies, like, way up here. Put dies in, like, this top row. <laughs> Rename it. Uh, we'll, 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 we'll name it. We'll just straight up name it dies. Because probably going to fill this whole entire thing up with dies. Dyes, these dyes are actually worth a good bit of money if you sell them. I don't know why they're worth so much if you sell them, because they're not, like, the hardest thing to get in the game. Strange plants spawn everywhere. I think you can get gold for some dyes. Uh, let's see, actually. This glowing mushroom dye is, like, pure trash. I thought it'd be dope. Like, I don't even know what's going on with it. It's not terrible, but I, I don't like it. I don't like it. I did get a fish costume. I'm wearing like half of it because it looks weird with like my equipment that going on, got going on, especially the winter cape. But uh, let me talk to uh, him, her. Well, I guess it doesn't matter who we sell it to. See, look, two gold and twenty-five silver for this die. Might as well. No, I'm not gonna do it actually. I'm just gonna go put it in here. Uh, we can't quick stack because then the quick stack but I thought it would just like think that all dies are the same and allow me to quick stack I guess not I got this ginger beard I can't really wear it because uh it's an equipable and I need to take off a mask to wear it I don't know about that I don't know about that okay I ain't doing it but we got a lucky horseshoe let me talk to the guide really quick so I'm about to do jump cut until daytime comes around and I might fight some uh, King Slimes, because I need gold. Uh, oh, you can't combine that. I don't know what's wrong with me. Aha, you can. Okay. We are going to combine these. Go fart in a balloon. I bet that smells good. Uh, so let's talk to the goblin. We will reforge this. Yeah, that worked out perfectly. Damn, I don't even, I don't even need to, uh, jump that hard, jump that hard, yep, I don't need to, what's it called, use my rocket boots, or specter boots, which I actually made because I found the goblin, so yeah, I did a lot of things off camera, uh, I still gotta find the enchanted sword, but yeah, I'll be right back once we, once the time swings around, I'll also be making crimtain armor, so yeah, I'll see you guys in a bit. So the next time swinging around, we made a little bit, uh, of edits to our arena here. I got this beautiful King Slime mask now. Thank God for that. And uh, we should be ripped up and ready to go, I believe. Let me just talk to my pig really quick here, man. Carry that for me, will you? Let's do this. Oh, God. Get out of here. I don't need none of this right now. Alright. What a old man. V2. <gasps> 
You know, it'd be nice if he got hit by like a star or something. Oh, hey. Hey, got you there. Oh, hey, hey, got you there. Got you. Oh, my. Oh, look how fast he is. God damn. We're just gonna, we're just gonna, we're just gonna take a billion damage. Oh, my God. We lost already. We lost. There's no hope in bringing this back. Oh, my. What the fuck? What did I do wrong? It's because I jumped off the fucking platform to dodge this stupid... Okay, I have to go over. Let me we... swing back from this. It's going to be annoying, too, but uh, it's possible. It's very possible. Where's that other hand? Oh, thank God. We got the pimp hand strong on this one. There's his other hand. I didn't even see that thing. Oh, God. I mean, you can fight him. Oh my god, I can fly, holy shit. You can fight him uh, with, uh, this is terrible. That's probably the worst fight yet. <laughs> Remember when I said he was easy? I fought him in multiplayer where I pretty much did, like, all of his health by myself. So my multiplayer partner died on me. And uh, it was expert mode too, so. I, t I don't know what's going on now. I don't know what's going on now. Maybe I just suck. I used the yo-yo the whole entire fight, too, so... Ooh, okay. Caught myself there. Should I just, like, aim for his head when he does spins? I don't know what I'm thinking! Okay, there you go. Just, like, hover... Oh, my God, that's terrible. Just lets his hands hover sometimes, and it's annoying. Jesus Christ, what was that move? Oh, we dead. We dead. We ain't living. We dead. Yep. Oh, my gosh. And, and, what the fuck happened there? <laughs> and, I talk too much shit, I get wrecked. Jesus. Alright, well, I'll be back in like a day. Like a 24 hours. Maybe not 24 hours. But at least like 16 hours IRL, because I don't want to be playing this shit till like 2 a.m. Boom, so we're going for another attempt here. Remember when I talked shit about Skeletron? This is what happens when you talk shit about bosses on expert mode, you get wrecked. And I'm gonna admit to it, I thought he was actually not that bad. Because like I said, I did fight him primarily by myself and got him down to most health until my co-op partner arrived. And uh, I got a bunch of potions here. I found the enchanted sword. Not in this world. I wanted to do as legit as I can. And when I mean that, I wanted to find it in this world specifically. I cannot find anything. I found like a bunch of fake ones. So I had to generate like two worlds and I finally got one. And I enchanted it. And I didn't want it. Uh, I didn't want it to. English. I didn't want to spend more money on it. And I just left it at the massive enchantment. So we're going to fight Skeletron. We got potions. Uh, I modified the code one again, which you get from the traveling merchant. And uh, what else do I have here? I got this from fishing. Switched out a little bit of my equipment because we got the brown string. Just give us a little bit more range. Hey, can you get on this bitch? Get on this bitch. All right, let's do this. Oh, this is not a good start. Hold up. Hold up. Got to we're, we're hopping right in. I was just waiting for nighttime for a while here, and I, here we go. We're just going to hop right in. Uh-oh. This is not good. I can't move. Fuck. We already lost the end. I should just uh, quit out. We already lost. That usually means we lose. Holy fuck. I just got like stuck in that chain. Alright, I oh I didn't know he was gonna do it twice in a row. E I don't know. I fought him with yo-yos before. Maybe it's because I used a different yo-yo. I used the Amazon, which you get from the jungle. And I was thinking about stopping by the jungle in an episode to uh get the Amazon and maybe the leaf blade, but I never got around to it because I wanted to fight this guy. I wanted also to get the enchanted sword. Uh, I need to do that. There's like something about, something in the config about being able to like highlight your cursor. What the fuck? How did I take se- What? What? How the fuck did I take 77 damage from that? What? What the fuck? No, wait, what? That was like the smallest fucking- What? Okay, thank god I didn't even- Thank god we're fighting him again, because I didn't even buff myself with the potions. And uh... Oh, he's not here. God damn it. The worst turn of events, man. 
This is some bullshit. Alright, I guess we're going to the jungle. I don't really have a choice now. Botch that fight three times in a row. I'm not waiting. Well, I, I have no choice but to wait to fight him again. But I'm not going to do it in this episode anymore. So fuck it, I don't, I don't want to wait for this episode. This episode took me like two days to record. I'd rather just go explore the jungle. We're not even going to explore it that much. Uh, because this episode's probably already like 10 minutes of just like fighting him. And I don't want to record a lot because I recorded this like long one hour thing. Two hour thing. I don't even know how long it was. It's a pretty long thing. And uh, that will be released eventually. It's a sort of a gaming podcast. us live stream. I don't know, actually live stream. Not until I get a better computer. But Ryan is in it with me. And he does the live streaming part. And uh, that will be released very soon. We'll try and do it once every week. I gotta talk too much about it though. Let's playing Terraria right now. I'm playing Terraria. Hey, so the Minecraft update. All right, let's uh, see if we can find the entrance of the jungle. What the hell happened there? Oh, oh, whoa, piranha! So I guess we can get the Amazon here. What the fuck is happening? I'm bouncing around, I'm getting fucking passed around like a. Not gonna. Not gonna finish that sentence. That's, I was about to say that was very uh, rude. And now let's just let's just you know. Hello, my name is Game Ready. So we're gonna use this sword here. This is a new enchanted sword which fires a beam. I've gotten one of these in hard mode. It's called like the beam sword or something like that. And it was it helped me in uh was it my mage playthrough? It helped me a lot in my mage playthrough when I ran out of mana. I'm just like hey I got this backup sword just in case I do run out of mana. We're good to go to use this baby. That's exactly what I did. So, uh, Amazon pretty easy to make. Uh, will I be getting Knight's Edge? I, I don't know. I feel like Knight's Edge will definitely be something I want to get. Some that would seem like it would help me out a lot if I got it. So I probably will get it. But, uh. I want to do something with our house now. I might remove our house and where it is right now, even though having it like near spawn, the regular spawn point, is a good thing. Because I think if you leave the game and then come back, well, not really leave the game, but quit out of your map and come back, wherever you set your spawn point on the bed, it's not going to be there anymore. Ooh, annoying wand of sparking, my favorite. Don't we have one of those? No, that wasn't this playthrough. There's another one. Uh, let's just break all this. Get this cobweb out of the way. Catch this grubby. Catch. There you go. 15% is not bad. You can actually make this bait right here. This enchanted nightcrawler. Which I haven't made yet. I haven't found too much use for it. Uh, I haven't had like a crazy need to catch fish. Uh, you get the good loot. You know, you can get the sailfish boots and everything. But I'm already fairly equipped. And this is like the first 1.3 character I didn't use fishing to get a bunch of goodies to get equipped. And I'm surprised a lot. And let's quick stack. Okay. So, I hear a whole lot of ribbiting going on here. A little grubby. I'm just gonna stock up on bait though. When, when I do fish, we will have the fish ready. And we're looking for spores. Usually, the usual stuff you find in the jungle. Uh, we can also make a shock room if we want, but I don't, I don't know. This is a bunch of weapons in Terraria that I'm like, nah, why would anyone use that weapon? Or even blink an eye towards that, trying to get that weapon. One of them is uh, flails in general. Flails are okay, but now with yo-yos in the game, it's just like, who the fuck? Like, I'd use a boomerang over a flail. Boomerangs, they bounce back towards you. Okay, here's something I really wanted to find. I, I've seen pictures about this right here. Hold on, let me break. Let me break some of this. I've seen pictures about this right here. Is this what I? Yeah. Okay. So this is a giant mangrove tree, just like the giant trees up uh, on the surface, and they have a chest. Yeah. Okay. It's exactly like I remember. Okay. That's uh, that's decent. That's, that's okay, loot. Could have been better, but uh. So I'll take this here. I don't really have a choice, do I? I want to make our house a lot uh, more unique, I guess you can say. So I might be doing something in the near future. And it might be like the removal of our snow biome. Snow biome. Snow biome and turning it into a jungle biome. Uh, with seeds and stuff. Because uh, 
I like the giant belt. Ah, I like the jungle biome. It's a lot better. Well, it's one of the cooler biomes in the game. Can you, can you die? That or we'll turn into a mushroom biome. Mushroom biome can work out well, too. Besides, like, angry zombies spawning in. That's, I don't want a recall potion. Did I pick up that stinger? I don't feel like I picked up that stinger. There was one here, wasn't there? I don't know. I'm not really paying attention. Yeah, there was. Oh, there it is right there. What the hell? How'd they get over here? What in the hell? Uh, we don't have the ability to wire things yet. Because I was going to help myself out here with Skeletron. It's not that he's hard. It's just, it's more of if you don't know how to dodge that, like, attack that I keep on getting stuck in. There's that one attack that I keep on getting stuck in, then you're fucked. And every time I've been stuck in that attack, I've been fucked. Because once you get past that attack, and you're able to dodge it multiple times until you get rid of his hands, just sustain him and boom, you just gotta take him out after that. And the strategy I'm using with the houses, the little roofed houses, is he does a little... When he's just ahead and you break both his hands. Because uh, if you don't break both of his hands, he's a lot harder to fight. Uh, he gets a certain amount of health, he starts firing like little skulls at you. And uh, that, that's why I'm trying to get rid of, this is a queen bee, we're not fighting the queen bee, queen bee is hard, I don't want to fight her, uh, at least not down here, but we don't really have a choice, do we, because I have to open up a really big area if I'm going to fight her down here, um, but yeah, you start shooting skulls and then that's when shit gets crazy, and you hide under the roof when you start shooting skulls and then you just wait until he does a spin attack, and then you run back out into the open area to run away from him. That's how you fight Skeletron. That's how I went through. And uh, it's not too... It shouldn't be too bad. I shouldn't have that many uh, problems fighting him. But uh, you never know. He, uh, maybe I was just... I got lucky with AI the first time I went through him. And maybe now I'm getting like fucked in the ass. By a skull. With no legs or a penis. But he's still fucking me in the ass. Let's get to this treasure. And then I think I'm going to end off this episode. Let's just, can you just, give me, give me away over there, I'm lazy man, give me, give me over there quick, pronto, 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 yeah, I got another strange plan here, I should probably trade in, can we move that over there, clear up some slots please, how'd my inventory get so full, we only found like two chests, holy shit, uh, where is, my trough, and let's quick stack. Come on, man. Let me clear my inventory really quick. Okay. I'll put this. We can shift click things. Boom, 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 boom. And we'll keep that. Boom, okay. So I'm, uh, I'll am i make the Amazon. Uh, I believe it is spores and stingers is the simple recipe to make Amazon. That's the yo-yo, the jungle yo-yo. And I think there's only like a couple other yo-yos. We can get now the reason why I'm using yo yo's because they're really good. Duh. Sorry. They are amazing. I'm not sorry for the burp. I'm sorry for claiming yo yo's are really good. They're amazing. They're not really good. They're fucking amazing. Oh, there's another treasure chest we can get. And that's why I'm using them. I don't know if I'll if I'm gonna use them primarily, I probably will. Because they're that good. Uh, but I don't know how they will be late game. This is fucking garbage! <laughs> 